CNN Headline News Update. Okay, good afternoon, folks. Larry Pesavento with the update for today, which is February the 12th. And uh, I want to show the chart of the E-mini S&P. You can see the large ABCD pattern that is forming here uh, up around 5080. We're trading at 5063 today, so we're getting very, very close to that spot. Uh, on my show coming up, I'm going to be talking about the dot-com bubble and how well did ABCD perform during the dot-com bubble. That was very interesting that year because the dot-com bubble, the Dow Jones topped in January, the NASDAQ didn't top until March, so there was two different markets, so that's why you've got to watch each of them separately. But we've got a gold market that's coming down to where we think will be a great buying opportunity, down about another 50 or $60 if it gets to that level. And then also we're looking at the bond market because the bond market is not rallying. If the interest rates are supposed to be dropping, bonds should be rallying and they're not. So when the market is doing something that what other than it should with the news, one should pay attention to that. It's trading at 119, the high had been 125 and a half. So this is not good action in the Treasury bonds. Now, I would like to mention one other thing is our guest today is going to be Mike Moore of Moore Analytics. Always has some really good stuff about crude oil. And we're coming up against some really strong resistance. It's crude oil up here at this $78 a barrel. Again, that's anticipated resistance. At any time, it can explode, do what's going on to the Middle East, uh, even though it's not in the – well, it's in the news every day, but not 24 hours a day like it usually is. So those are the things that we're going to be following here this morning. We're going to look at the trades that we're in, some of the trades that we'll be looking at, and we'll answer any questions that you might have if I can answer them for you. That's mainly what I'm here for, so hopefully we'll have some fun. So if you have any questions, it's 877 927 Six six four eight, and I'll be happy to answer them the best I can. Now I see that my time is forty seconds too short, which is what I usually do. But I did want to mention I'll bring up this chart here just to show you uh, where I'm going to start here. I want to show you the 1974 stock market bottom and why it was so important in my life and lives of my friends. <laughs> we'll be right back. Eight seven seven nine two seven six six four eight. 